welcome. Today in the last video of the year, we're going to talk about the year in review at Assembly AI for 2022. So as YouTube creators, we cannot just pass over all the work that we've done this year. So here are the most watched three videos from 2022. Number one is getting started with Hugging Face in 15 minutes. In this video, we talk about how you can use Hugging Face's amazing models in just 15 minutes. On the second place is how does Dolly 2 actually work? We actually published this video on the same week or the week after Dolly 2 was launched or announced and it was received with a lot of excitement that which made us really happy. And the last video that did really well this year was Diffusion Models Explained in Four Difficulty Levels. And we decided to make this video after we realized that many models that came out this year are using Diffusion Models as a basis. So it only makes sense to learn about them and make sure that everyone has a reliable resource in front of them to understand how these strong models are made. On the short side though, we had two videos that were specifically liked by a lot of people. One of them is called how to use OpenAI API in Python in 45 seconds. And the second one was our comparison video between deep learning and traditional machine learning. All right, so let's talk about some other general news and exciting stuff that happened this year. First of all, we grew our team. I think when I started, we were like 20 people and now we are more than 60, which was super exciting to see. Then we had not one, but two funding rounds this year. We raised $28 million in Series A and 30 million in Series B, which now gives us a lot of runway to accelerate our product roadmap, build out our AI infrastructure and grow our our research team and all other teams of course. Then we launched our assembly AI playground where we can test all our AI models for free. So you can simply paste in a YouTube link like for this video and then can turn on transcription, summarization and all other AI models. So you can go to assemblyai.com slash playground and try it yourself. Then, and this is a really cool one for me, we launched the Assembly AI Creators Program, a community of other creators in the AI space who grow together, talk about AI news and create content to help other developers work with our APIs. So shout out to all our creators. And if you want to join the community too, you can check out the link here and learn more about this program. Then we also hosted our very first hackathon, the AI Winter Hackathon in December with more than 440 participants from 84 different countries. So we had a lot of fun on this weekend and it was amazing to see what everyone could build in just two days. Hopefully we will host another one next year, so stay tuned. And then we also had different team offsites where we could meet our team members for the first time in person. In my case, my team went to New York and spent a couple of days there. So for example, we went bowling, had lots of great dinners and drinks, but of course we also worked together. So for the first time ever, we could brainstorm together in the same room and not only over Zoom, which was really cool and also productive. So next year we are also having more offsites. Maybe you want to join them too. So check out our open roles on our career page if you're interested to join us. But at the end of the day, Assembly AI is trying to bring you the latest state-of-the-art models that you can use through a very simple API. So here are the updates that we had to Assembly AI throughout 2022. One of the biggest highlights was our improved transcription model. It is our most accurate transcription model to date. And throughout the year, we launched support for many different languages, including Japanese, Dutch, Portuguese, French, German, Italian, Spanish, and Hindi. Recently, we released our Assembly AI CLI to help developers test our AI models directly from their terminal. And in 2022, we also launched our summarization model with which you can get summaries of your audio files in many different formats. So this could be a paragraph, a bullet pointed list, or maybe just a sentence, or maybe even a couple of words where you can get just a gist of this audio. And with the latest update we had, you can also decide what kind of summary you like, for example, conversational, informative, or a catchy one, for example, you can use as a title to your podcast. And all in all, I can say this was a really successful year and I'm looking forward to the next one. So happy new year and see you again in January. Bye. Thank you for following us and being part of the Assembly AI YouTube family so far. We are looking forward to bringing you more informative and exciting content in 2023. Happy new year.